make electricity It's just moving to the stand Hey guys, Jenem Shear, and this is another Minecraft Bedrock Edition video. And this is the Village and Pillage update. Um, these are basically just the betas. I'm giving you an overview of what has been added and changed in these updates. So let's get right into the video. But before I do that, I need to give a small little shout out to my friend Sant Squad. His channel link will be in the description, so go check him out. He has some cool vlogs. Just go check him out. Okay, so, first thing that was added, and this is not the first thing, obviously, because it's in 1.9, but it is the smooth blocks. These are the stone smooth block, which looks pretty cool. Then there is the uh, smooth sandstone block, which has been changed. It used to be the old smooth sandstone, which is now called cut sandstone. So that's pretty cool. This sand right here is smooth. This is cut sandstone. So they've changed that. And then we have the same thing with the red sandstone. This is red smooth sandstone. And this is smooth quartz. There isn't really a difference between the quartz and um, the block of quartz and smooth quartz. But they just added it for no apparent reason. We have the slab. There's a bunch of new slabs. This is the smooth stone slab. Oh, sorry. That's just stone slab. Sorry. Um, stone slab. But they require smooth stone to craft. So that that's kind of a weird thing. But yeah, you'll have to get used to that. Uh, there's stairs behind it too. There's stairs for all of these. Then next we have the... don't remember the name. The diorite, I believe. Slabs. Then we have andesite slabs. Then we have granite slabs. Then we have mossy stone brick slabs. Mossy cobblestone. Because they changed the name of... Um, Moss stone to mossy cobblestone because they didn't want to confuse these two and a few other ones. Then we have the sand, sandstone slab. I think this is smooth sandstone. Red, um, red sandstone, whatever. Smooth sandstone. And the quartz, smooth quartz slabs and stairs, of course. And then the nether, nether wart, I believe. I did not mean to break that there, that's why I should be careful. And they also have the ender brick. Nether brick and ender brick. Go the two. They have the brick. Whatever was here, it was andesite. Then they have diorite. Um, granite. This is the C. C1, I forgot what it's called. Stone brick. Mossy, mossy stone brick. Um, then that's sandstone. That's red sandstone, nether ward, and um, nether brick and end brick walls. That's pretty cool. And one of the greatest features they added are different um, signs. So now this just called the sign before has turned into just in not just but an oak sign. Yeah. So if you, if you look it up in here, you'll get oak sign. Spruce sign, 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 okay, and dark oak. So some other features that were added in 1.9 are these kind of useless objects. They're not use, they're not necessarily useless, but they don't work in 1.9 so far in the beta. But they will work in the future, like they do on Java Edition. So the first one is the cartography table. Make sure I have my sword in my hand. Cartography table, fletching table, grindstone, bell barrel, then this is the smithing table, this is the smoker, this is the blast furnace, and this is the lantern, which actually, it works halfway, it, you can't use it in survival, it's creative only right now, all of these I believe are creative only, but um, this does emit light, so um, a light level of 15, which is more than torches, so that's a cool fun fact right there. These are two new flowers added in 1.9. This is the corn flower right here. And the lily of the valley, I believe. Let me check. Yes, corn flower and lily of the valley. And from these, you can get blue dye and white dye, which leads to what they added in 1.8. They added the four different colors um, of dyes, which is black, brown, white, and blue instead of just using lapis, bone meal, ink sacks, and cocoa beans. So that's pretty cool, So, but you can still use them if you want to. You can still use the cocoa beans, ink sacks, bone meal, 
or lapis lazuli if you want to but there's a dye specifically for that color now next we have the pillager over here this guy not little guy is pretty big has a crossbow <laughs> he wields a crossbow so you already know he's scary and we haven't even talked about crossbows yet which we're adding 1.8 we'll get there soon though so this guy will attack villagers and will attack humans it's a hostile mob um just be careful because it has it has 24 health which is 12 hearts so that's more than um you do in survival you have 10 hearts so that's pretty bad um so you better be careful when you you attack them They're pretty dangerous good luck next i'm gonna talk about bamboo forest this is bamboo right here which is added in 1.8 um along with the panda so um bamboo forests are basically variants of a jungle um, you'll find it somewhere in the world, hopefully. And it has pandas, bamboo, and podzul, which is a... I swear I had it down here somewhere. Podzul. Yeah, it's right here. It's this block right here. It's something that the pandas really loved <laughs> to be. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Another cool feature, actually it was listed as a change, but a feature is this. Cauldrons can now hold lava. That's pretty cool. That's awesome. Finally. Just wish they could hold milk, but yeah. I don't know if they're gonna ever add that feature. Another feature they added is immediate respawn, which is in the settings. I'll show you. It is in leave it's in your world settings. So game. Go under game. Immediate respawn. So what does that do? Every time you die, even if you do slash kill at E you will you will respawn right away you don't get the um, option to exit game or um, respawn you don't get those options you just automatically respawn which is kind of cool but could also be bad in a few ways so yeah another feature or another change actually um, is tripwire activated when broken so when you if there were tripwire right here tripwire hooks and stuff like that if I broke it, it would be activated, which is really good because it would be cheating to break it. And then a way to get past that is just use shears. So that's pretty cool. I love that feature. It really helps. As a redstoner, <laughs> it really helps. On to 1.8. Okay. I know we're going backwards, but it's fine. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is this scaffolding block. Sorry. It's a climbable block. See, it's easy to very, it's very easy to walk through it. But it is a climbable block, basically, made from bamboo. That's pretty much what it is. It's like horse fruit. If you break the one on the bottom, oh, sorry. These are very loose. If you break it, it'll break the top one. So, on to some features that aren't as weird. We have the crossbow, which is a very cool feature, but a very deadly feature. So, be very careful. Crossbows. So I think they're easier to use on PC and Windows 10, and you know why? Because on Android and, I and Apple devices, you have to hold it, and then you have to hold it again to shoot. But on PC and Windows 10, you'd have to hold the trigger or the the mouse, the click, and then you just click it. You don't have to hold it. But since I'm on Android and I'm not using my controller, it's pretty much harder. So you have to deal with that, but now let's get to the enchantments for crossbows, because they are really cool. I promise you that. There are three encha enchantments, they're all new. Quick charge, and there's three quick charges, one, two, three. Uh, piercing, there's four of those. And multi-shot, there's only one. Level, level one. So multi-shot, so piercing and I believe multi-shot cannot be used on the same one. Let me check. Yeah, multi-shot and piercing cannot be used on the same one which sucks but yeah it, it'd be kind of even worse I mean that's like that's like the best weapon in the game so piercing pretty cool probably won't notice it unless I attack someone but multi shot and quick charge at the same time that's deadly shoots three. Oh my gosh that that's that's too deadly that's it's pretty bad so let's put those back in Let's get to the next feature. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the pandas. And I've, I have a fun fact about these pandas. Um, I've already told you that they spawn in jungles. Um, they eat bamboo. They also eat cake items. Um, I think that's when you throw uh, a 
you throw a cake down, not when you place it down, but like when you throw it down, I think. I might be wrong about that, tell me if I'm wrong in the description. But a fun fact is they have six personalities. Normal, aggressive, weak, lazy, worried, playful. Um, they are weak, they'll sneeze more often than the other other um, personalities. They have a small chance of sneezing out a slime ball. That's very cool. I mean, it's very rare, but I mean, they sneeze out a slime ball. That's pretty cool. I mean, I need those in my survival world, so... I mean, uh, you want to season out now? Season out. And I think our last feature for today is the lovely cats. So, these two over here, they're cats. This is an ocelot. And actually, I will kill this off because we don't need it right now. I don't know why I put it in here. I think I just want to tell the difference. So, ocelots. They are not tameable anymore. You cannot tame them. Cats are tameable. These are... Uh, they spawn in villages. They scare creepers. And phantoms, which is awesome. That's amazing. Um, they're immune to fall damage, which I just learned. That's... That's very weird. And they bring gifts to you. If you're their owner. So, I don't know what kind of gifts. I've never experienced that yet, but... That's pretty cool. And I think I've gone through every single feature here. This is the Village and Pillage update 1.8 and 1.9. This is a very cool update. And I think you guys will enjoy it, so you guys should check out the beta. 1.9 is out right now for Androids, um, Xbox One, Windows 10, and all of those. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share. See you guys later. Love you all. Jedem Chow.